click on the link in the description below to go to the YouTube Intro Maker website from Animaker. Once you reach the website, click on this create icon in the center and you will be redirected towards a new sign up page. If you are new to Animaker, enter your details and sign up. If you already have an account, log in over here. Once you are done signing up, you will be redirected to the dashboard page of Animaker. Go to the search bar over here and type intro. Once you type the word, you can see there are a lot of suggestions. Click on the intros and outros suggestion over here. Once you click on it, you will be redirected towards the template page of Animaker. Here you have a lot of intro and outro templates that you can make use of in your YouTube videos. Click on this preview icon over here to have a look at the template. If you are fine with the template, click on this use icon over here. Once you click on it, a new window with a selected template will open. This is the interface of Animaker application. Center you have the workspace, right side you have the scene section, bottom you have the timeline section and in the left you have the library or the asset section. As a first step, upload the logo of your channel. To upload the logo, go to the upload section present in the left side bottom of the application. Click on it and again click on this upload icon. It will open the file explorer, select the logo of your YouTube channel and click open. Once you click on it, it will load the logo into the application. Now I am going to replace this current logo with the uploaded logo. To do that, select the current logo and click on the swap option over here. Click on it and then select the uploaded logo and it will automatically replace the current logo with the uploaded one. Now select apply. If you want to increase or decrease the size of this new logo, you can do that by dragging one of its corner. As a second step, I want to edit the text. To edit the text, click on the text and type the name of your YouTube channel. Let's say the name of my YouTube channel is education tech. So I'm going to type education. Now selecting the second text box and typing tech. You can also edit this text by using the options over here. I can change the font style over here font color over here and then font size over here now as the final step we are going to add a music track to this video you can add your own music track in the same way we uploaded this logo just click on this upload icon you would be able to upload the music track into the application or you can also make use of the music tracks present within the application to do that go to the music section over here and within the music section, you have a lot of royalty free music tracks. All you have to do is keep the pointer over any of the music track, you'll be able to hear the actual music track. Once you are fine with the music track, just click on this plus icon over here. It will add the music track to the video. Let's have a preview of all the changes that we made. To have a preview, click on this preview icon over here. If you are fine with the video, just go to the publish icon over here and click download video and then download. Once you click on download, it will take a few minutes to render your video and you will be redirected towards a new download page. Here you can have a preview of your download. You can download the video using the option over here. You can edit it again if you want using the icon over here. You can also share this link using your mail id over here. It is that simple to create an intro for your YouTube video using Animaker. So what are you waiting for? Click on the link in the description and create your awesome looking intro for your YouTube videos.